Greening Australia was engaged by Jennifer Fern from the Queensland University of Technology to facilitate a research project on restoring eucalypt forests via direct seeding methods for biodiversity and carbon sequestration benefits. The project site is located in the Logan City Council area on a river flat of Scrubby Creek in Cedar Vale, 60 kilometres south of Brisbane. Direct seeding is not widely implemented in Queensland compared to other states and territories. Thus, one of the main objectives was to test the success of implementing direct seeding rather than planting established tube stock. Another objective was to test the success of seed from various provenances or areas in order to return results regarding climate change and climate adaptation. Seed of Corymbia citriodora, the spotted gum, and Eucalyptus teredocornis, the forest red gum, were sourced from northern, southern and local area populations. Once the seeds were obtained, preparation began to construct seed balls, formed by combining the seed, fertiliser, clay, seaweed solution and water together, a technique which provides protection to the seed and nutrients for when it germinates. The direct seeding will be occurring in two stages. Stage one has occurred with the Greening Australia team undertaking weed control, then sowing the seed balls following the colour-coded stakes which mark the position of the various tree species and provenances. The project has been a great success to date. Now it's time to play the waiting game until stage two when a further two species of nitrogen-fixing acacia will be installed at the site. All involved hope to see some positive on-ground results with the prospect of delivering long-term resilient forests for the future.